You are the reason why I lift my hands, why I lift my voice, why I sing to you. Hello, lovely viewers. This is your girl, Evie. Welcome to Tasty and Fresh Kitchen, where we always prepare tasty meals with fresh ingredients. So today, I bring to you this mouth-watering kukunti recipe, okay? So over here, I am going to teach you the simplest method to prepare your kukunti or face the wall. So this is one and a half cup of cassava flour, or the kukunti flour. I have neatly sieved it and you can see how smooth and fluffy it is. Okay, so let's go. So in my pot, I'll just pour the flour in it like I'm doing here. And then add some water to it. So depending on how soft or how tough or hard you want it, yeah, you add the water. So I have added one cup of water to it. So I'll just stir, just like I am making banku. So you see, you can see our mixture is smooth. There are no lumps in it. Good. So this is the consistency I want. So now straight to the fire. So no adding of salt. So now I am going to keep stirring. So it thickens up just like it's doing over here. So just like you are making banku, you understand? No stressing, up putting hot water and blah, 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 blah. Just go straight to this process and you are good to go. So once it thickens, I begin to knead it like me camping queen. So what I see here. So you need to knead so it's ready. Yeah, so there will be no lamps. And trust me, kukunte or face the wall. I wonder how they got the name face the wall. It's nice. Especially when you get the right cassava flour like mine here. It is just like fufu. You can see my kokonte is doing great here. Are you trying? <laughs> so I just add a little water. Yeah, because I realized it was a bit tough or adding kakra. I want my a bit softer, like medium. So I'll just add a little water and then allow it to boil and then still keep kneading. Just look at it. My kokonte or Chris Brown or face the wall is ready. Very simple to prepare. It doesn't take much time and it is gluten free. Yeah, it's very light. Once you eat it, I mean, you feel very light. So please, friends and family, I bet you please try some cooking tea, okay? I know preparing sometimes can be easy, especially when you are using the old method. But trust me, this is the newest method. This is how I do my cooking tea and my family really enjoy it, okay? <laughs> so now our cooking tea or face the wall is ready. So I'll just transfer into my adding work that's my asanka i'll just dress it neatly here and then i am going to enjoy my with some peanut butter soup of which i'll share a recipe how i made my peanut butter soup and then i'll garnish with some okra and I am good to go. You know, Sundays are for swallows. So why don't you join me? Let's enjoy this mouth-watering, eye-catching, finger-licking kokonte with peanut butter soup. If you like this video, just give your girl some thumbs up, 
like comment and subscribe okay so come 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 let's enjoy some lunch okay see you in our next video bye bye i love you guys Mwah. <laughs>